submarine. Submarine. Hot air balloon. Hot air balloon. Motorbike. Motorbike. Tram. Tram. Underground. Underground. There will be undergrounds in the future. There won't be undergrounds in the future. There will be submarines in the future. There won't be submarines in the future. There will be helicopters in the future. There won't be helicopters in the future. There will be hot air balloons in the future. There won't be hot air balloons in the future. There will be motorbikes in the future. There won't be motorbikes in the future. There will be trams in the future. There won't be trams in the future. Okay, hello again. Ready? So let's move on to your pupil's book, page number 76. 76. In this uh, part of the unit, we've been learning new words of vocabulary, which are submarine, helicopter, hot air balloon, motorbike, tram, underground, and you already know many other uh, forms of transport. But the most important part in this, um, in this page is that we're gonna still working with the future okay and as remember that we use will to make sentences right to make affirmative sentences and we use want to make negative sentences okay so let's remember we use will and one to talk about the future let's listen to this and then we'll explain it motorbikes will travel under the sea in the future cars won't have wings in the future. Children will live on the moon in the future. Submarines won't fly in the future. Okay, so that's the most important thing. We use will for affirmative sentences and we use want for affirmative sentences. Is we use it when we want to talk about something that will happen in the future. So it can be tomorrow, in two days' time, three days' time, in a few weeks, in a few years, right? But referring always to the future. So, for example, here we've got some examples that things we think will be like in the future. Cars will have wings in the future. Robots will uh, live on the moon or robots will do all the chores schools won't exist in the future or robots will be your teachers in the future whatever okay okay so let's make a few sentences in the future okay we're gonna make some sentences some affirmative sentences some negative sentences and also questions right here we've got an example using the new vocabulary. Submarines will travel under the sea in the future. That's the affirmative sentence. If we want to make it negative, remember to change the word will for the word want. Submarines won't travel under the sea in the future. Now we need to make the question. So for the questions, remember that we always turn things around a little bit. So the question would be, Will submarines travel under the sea in the future? And we've got two possible answers. The affirmative answer will be yes, they will. 
and the negative answer no they won't remember not to confuse when the question is will there be submarines in the future and we say we answer yes there will no there won't here in the question we do not have the word there no there so we shouldn't write it down in the answer remember yes they will no they won't another example could be another question will cars fly in the future two possible answers yes they will no they won't okay so let's remember bye bye Okay, so let's see a few sentences. For example, I think cars will fly in the future. How do we make that sentence negative? Come on, it'll be cars won't fly in the future. Very good. What about if I want to make the questions? What word should I write first? Will cars fly in the future and here we've got two possible answers right the affirmative one which will be yes they will and no they want okay we need to make sure we don't um confuse when the question is will there be nana -na -na in the future and we answer yes there will no there won't okay here we're talking about cars will cars fly in the future that's why we answer with they yes they will no they won't okay let's do another example for example let's say robots will will do all the chores right how do i make it negative what's the negative robots sorry robots won't do all the chores for the chores want to do the chores and if i want to make the uh, the question sorry it'll be will robots do all the chores okay and again what are the two possible answers that we've got yes they will and no they sorry what okay very good